just wanted to share a couple of uh, painting tips. There I am, paint the ceiling, and I used to. I've got this ladder that is really not for painting. It's got no way to secure a paint bucket. Some ladders have a little clip in the front. But I have that thing up there, and I was scared I was going to swing my elbow around when I was brushing, knock that thing over on the floor, and have a big mess to clean up. So I found this little bucket down in the basement, and uh, works real good. I just uh, drilled two holes, put in two bolts, and you know I can move this thing around. I don't have to worry about getting the uh, paint up and down, and you know you can knock it as hard as you want. It's not going to fall over. Another couple tips: uh, between coats, or even between days, I wrap my brush in foil, and then uh, you know when I'm done, of course, rinse them in the sink. And I've never used one of these uh, pouring spouts before with the bear, but uh, working pretty good. So I'm going to might continue to do that in the future. Uh, let's see what else. Oh, yeah. So I also wrap the roller in foil, getting ready for this to dry and to reuse. Uh, and then the paint bucket itself. I just put, uh, see over there in the corner, I put a kitchen trash bag over that. Still got paint in it, and that'll survive for a couple hours while the rest of this dries. So what I, my end goal is to put up uh, some of these can lights. So I did these the other day. I'm going to put four more up in here. Get ready for Thanksgiving. And <laughs> I know you're admiring the wallpaper. It's got to be 30 years old. But uh, I'm going to leave that up for now. And you can buy tape. It's called, uh, oh, I don't know, sensitive tape or sensitive. It's called delicate surface tape. Delicate surface. And I'm going to use that to uh, prevent getting uh, paint on the wallpaper. And hopefully it'll peel right off and not bring the wallpaper with it. That's it. Kind of a silly video, I know. But, uh, you know, I try to find something, you know, the find hooks and this and that and of course a real paint ladder has got a ledge right there but still you know you could knock over pretty easy but this is working great for me i just leave it up there move it around yeah if this was helpful at all give it a like and uh subscribe and have a great day we'll see you